Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Both fighters are 31 with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. To get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 218 pounds. Fighting out of Lakewood, Colorado, USA, Dynamite. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, commit to the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. gets underway and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands. Oh! Really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Just missed with the left there. Big kick land. Flip to avoid that right hand. Oh, and he caught the kick. Lee 
gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Look at how he turns his hit into that leg kick. What a punch. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. He is all about that left kick to the body. Lee gets hit with that hook shot there. He's got to be careful to not allow the offense to follow up here. Big kick lands. Ooh, he landed a huge hook there. Oh, man, that could have felt good. The flush knee lands to the body by the taller fighter. Beautiful body kick. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Lands with the kick there. No pad on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Checks that leg kick. Big hard punch land. Now he gets back to range. There's no tell on that leg kick. Oh, big left hand there. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Lee's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Counters now left hook to the head lands. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Nice head kick. Able to check that kick as well. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, big hook. That'll leave a mark. Pretty good right hand. Good stick. Oh, and he caught the kick. And they separate. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. The horse, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. Probably lost that round. I need you to be first. Let's get that head movement and start popping that jab. Nice straight punch. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Big liver. and it landed exactly as he was hoping for. All right, Lance, a kick there, pretty well done. 
Really good accuracy landing that kick. Big body kick land. Nice punch by Lee. What a tricky head kick. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Lee. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Lee gets hit with a kick. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Able to check the high kick. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, some of the best kicks you'll see right there, live and in color. Just missing on the high kick there. Great punch landed with so much power. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Lee gets hit with a kick. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Oh, man, he to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Oh, straight right. Oh, single collar tie here. Big knee to the body. A right, little struggle here now for position in the clinch, and we see a lot of these situations in mixed martial arts where both fighters sort of end up getting comfortable here when there isn't a whole lot going on. And the moment somebody gets comfortable, the moment that somebody decides to relax, the moment you'll see a takedown, or somebody really... ...gets on the feet as a opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Cain Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he lands that overhand right, he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Oh, collar tie. Oh, now gets an underhook to get a more dominant position. Timing the shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Ten seconds now to go in the round. Oh, man. Uh -huh. You jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep.
All right, here we go with our next round, and really shades of the Diaz brothers in that previous round. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy, just a lot of efficiency on the field. Very, very efficient. Good round in the sense that he did not throw everything with absolute power, but he was touching the entire time. Then every now and again, he was set down to the strike that was really damaging his opponent. Nice kick landed there by Lee. Bunches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Blocks the shot. Got him. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. Now his opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on B Street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's going to do to stay in this fight. Oh, went for the spinning kick there. Telegraphed it a little bit. No good. Going with the kick to the body. He's an outstanding kicker, but that attempt missed. Nice strike. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Touched by that kick there. And there comes the separation now. So he lands another strike here to his opponent's liver. The defense has got to do something at this point in time. He was buckled with a similar shot earlier in the fight. Big body kick. Liver kick. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Right hook to the head blocked. Hands high, hands high. His leg is hurt here. You can see him limping a little bit. Here, different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Put your hands up higher. Come on. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. Just watch the ability to land anywhere. Straight right, he misses. He blocks the shot. Slips to avoid the right. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive uppercut win. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Big kick. Found the target with that left hand. Fifteen seconds remain in the round.
lot more than a puncher's chance coming in. Big knockdown for him in the previous round. DC, talk us through the highlight. He got in his opponent's face, landed that big punch that put his opponent flat on his back. He couldn't get the finish, but if he lands one more time just like that, he will get the victory. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Game of inches right there, oh, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. with every part of himself into these big leg kicks. right side of his body. I mean, he's cutting down the size with his beautiful leg kick. And he landed the right hand there. Beautiful kick. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. Just over three minutes to go. Right hook attempt. That's a miss. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, nice jab. catching the leg, so maybe you thought he would catch the leg and go for a takedown. Instead, he goes for the punch, and he certainly found the range on that one. Can't take many of those. You better check. Try to establish that jab. That's a big strike right there. Grips the body there. Way to hide that leg kick. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic... Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Nice right hand. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. 
flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighter saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliato has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, nine seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Dynamite! Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and candidly knocking another man out cold. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope for the knockout. But he was never hopeful. He was sure that he would get it done, and he did exactly that. Congrats.